Hey guys, Luke99 here with another LEGO custom big figure review. This time is another custom figure designed entirely by me, which I have named Wrecking Bull. So I obviously went off of a regular and typical design of a bull, because that is what his theme is around. So uh, his backstory is pretty simple. He's just been a bull for his entire life, but he got sick and tired of chasing after the moving red cape in arenas. So he broke free, learned to stand on two legs, got himself some human-looking clothing, and has just been uh, committing crimes ever since. So we should... that covers the backstory, really, so let's just get into the figure. Uh, I dremeled his feet so the toes wouldn't show, and then I dremeled in to look like kind of hooves, so it's indented, kind of like a V or a U. Got black Hulk ripped pants. A brown jacket, kind of like my Solomon Grundy. If you haven't seen him, check him out, please. He got the rips on the sides. He's got a an authentic gold nose ring. Not made out of real gold, but taken from a real piece of jewelry. He's got a mean expression. And some horns painted with white and then with khaki. So I'll just zoom in on his face real quick. Got a mean expression there with angry eyebrows. Good look at his nose ring and his horns. And so we can get started with the 360. I'm the most of his details on the front, except there's one big thing on the back, and you could probably see that right now is his tail. So this is just a view of the side of the head. And then he's got a tail made entirely out of green stuff, not movable or anything. But the standstill one I think looks pretty good for this figure. He's got coat tails, so his tail can fit out the side at the back out the back of his coat, which I think looks pretty cool. And then nothing, nothing much to see on the side. That brings us back around to the front. So it doesn't look like he has very much detail on him, but it took a lot of coats of paint, and the nose ring took a little bit of work, but it was definitely worth it. I think it's much cooler than having a green stuff one. So I guess I can just get a closer look at the feet. Dremeled in. Toes are not showing. And then his face. I did look at it. So that's basically it for this figure. I am very, very happy the way he turned out. And I may be starting to do a custom line of figures, along with uh, containing but not limited to Swatbot, Wrecking Bull, this guy, and a couple others that um, should be coming. I have ideas written down, and I will not hesitate to start making them into big figures, so stay tuned for all those. And um, also, if you want to see another coat like this, go to my Solomon Grundy video. And that's basically it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to check out my other, vid my other videos, and thanks. Bye.